Hey guys, today I'll put up the date. I'm doing a small adventure. I'm going to my native place, which is in Sakleshpur, on an Expulse. It's a 200cc engine, kilometers of open highway. If you want to know whether you can tour on Expulse 200. FI watch this video because I'm gonna tell you whether I liked it or not to ride it on highway so that is the topic exclusively I will speak on that I will not speak on anything else I'm already not feeling great about it to be frank because a lot of vehicles pass you and uh, but I have this uh, motor wings exhaust that's kind of keeping my spirits up because it sounds brilliant for a 200cc engine so yeah let's see how it goes guys that's the topic for this vlog if you don't want to know you can skip this video if you want to know about it just watch the video I will talk about it as and when I reach certain points uh, during my journey of 260 kilometers I started at 3 o'clock in the afternoon so it's a rainy season my place definitely it's gonna rain let's see how it all goes guys just an update guys I have done so far 120 kilometers so average speed is not great 68 kilometer per hour have done from my place in Bangalore to here 120 kilometers so far I need to go another 140 I will have more fun once I reach Hassan because uh, from Hassan it's not open highway so it would be real fun for sure all right guys so far I have done 167 hope you could see the screen two and a half hours 167 kilometers average speed is could see I think 71 km per hour that's the best I could do and I have maintained uh, wherever possible 100 plus only so yeah it's a beautiful uh, you know uh, mountains actually with uh, windmills so that's why I switched on the camera I don't know if the wind is too much and wind noise is too much or uh, you could hear me properly only I would know when I edit it I thought wind would be much tougher today but fortunately it's not otherwise my speed would have come down a lot All right, guys. Uh, so far, my experience. If you don't like speed, that means like you, you would be happy with 80 kilometers, even 100 kilometers per same. I think you can manage with expulse, even the long rides. But if you ask me, this is not the bike for me because I would still need another like 20-30 kilometers more speed on the console so that when you are overtaking or you know the quick bust would be much easier yeah that's my opinion now for now just leaving Hassan so one of the things I observed is 
because I have tried to ride at the higher speeds, petrol consumption went crazy. Crazy means crazy. So I the digital meter was showing almost full when I started in Bangalore and now it has only one bar left just one bar left my goodness so I have a modified exhaust I need to tell you that maybe that added to the consumption I don't know but my speed will not be drastically reduced in these bad roads because this bike is for this kind of roads and this kind of ride so let's see I need to fill up the petrol in Sakleshpur just leaving Hassan now so this is Sakleshpur uh, Mangalore Highway it doesn't look like a highway but this is it and a uh, lot of traffic so my experience in open highway bike is stable I think if you are uh, not very light in weight like if you are above 70 like me I think uh, you don't face any issues in the open highway when you are riding at um, like 80, 100, 110 that speed oh my goodness I need to tell you this I have done 200 plus kilometers 205 now you could see here everything average speed date everything I have not stopped I have not stopped anywhere and I'm using a, a air seat if you are okay with 80 to 100 speed I think you can tour on this bike it's not that bad for luggage also I think you can manage few kilos so only issue is if you like little bit of that top end this is not the bike for you because I like little bit of top end this is not the bike for me actually to tour on this I mainly purchased for city use for our stupid roads in uh, Bangalore much traffic I don't know what the hell is going on here last bar in the fuel meter is still not blinking if it starts blinking my heart rate will go up because I don't know where it will stop hopefully it is it is not uh, hopefully the fuel meter is very good otherwise I will be in trouble I need to search for petrol bunk yeah on my ninja this stretch would be a pain in the ass today I'm feeling it little bit because I have not stopped the bike uh, otherwise uh, this bike can eat up the bumps the bad road okay the stupid road
Okay, off-roading from Hassan. That's gonna be the title of this video now. to look at the potholes Look at this thing <laughs> In Ninja, I cannot do this That's why I did not bring my Ninja Even though that's the fun bike to ride From Hassan, I knew Expulse is gonna be the most fun bike to ride How do you ride a super bike here, man? Huh? State highway, the development is so damn slow. This development is happening since I think past uh, three, four years or five years, maybe more than that. <laughs> okay, guys. Just about to reach Sakleshpur and uh, I'm in the almost, I think, another 10-15 kilometers. Suddenly rain started. Fuck me. Suddenly rain started and uh, this, is, this is not a good thing. It's a very, very bad thing for me. And it is not gonna stop. That's the part worries me because that's how rain is in our side. It starts means it's not not gonna stop. I need to, you know, wear the rain gear and leave. That's what I need to do.